going on everybody welcome back to the channel it's your boy the huskamanian back in the building man yes sir we got the mayor debates man let's get it it's the beast from the east so you know you don't want to miss out on this man i hope y'all got y'all y'all popcorn y'all snacks y'all drinks man because it's gonna get good man but before we get into it make sure you hit up that like button and make sure you subscribe to the channel man with that out the way let's get right into it and welcome to the december 2020 mayoral debate of course we originally set Four mayors, which of course were Ticino, Troiden of the Western Wildcats, Grinding DF, and Shakedown 2012 of the South City Vipers. Each of the mayors had great terms, but the six weeks are almost up, which means new mayors are on the periphery. We're giving our four mayors three candidates to face off against. Some of the faces you've seen before, a lot of the guys top in social media and have been in the 2K community for a long time, a few of them are some of the top grinders in the game who have proven that they play a lot, they win a lot, and they deserve the opportunity to expand their platform and maybe a huge upset in this mayoral campaign. So let's learn about our mayoral candidates for each affiliation. Does everybody know each other? Let's start there. Obviously, Ticino is the incumbent mayor of the Beast of these. Uh, Stacks and Mo Buckets are two of our uh og streamers and represent the community in a great way and bash uh is an up-and-comer and has been grinding he's actually top five in rep for the beast of so he's one of your most valuable guys first question is a pretty obvious one uh for all of you which is tell us about your 2k reputation your story, where you came from, and why 2K is important to you, and why the mayorship would be important to you. Let's start with Yo Stacks. Yo, your boy Stacks, man. As far as my rep in the 2K community, uh, I haven't met one person that um, that I wasn't cool with or uh, had heard of me at some point. It's crazy too because since I started so long ago, a lot of the people that's coming up now said that I inspired them to start YouTube or start grinding on 2K and stuff like that. So, you know, that just, in general, is just something crazy to just, just to see. But as far as, uh, you know, what being a mayor would, would mean to me, it would just be the ultimate payoff for just how far I've come. Just uh, started uploading 2K videos back in like 2012. And now to be here, I'm, uh, you know, almost, what, almost, almost 10 years later and, you know, to be a mayor in the actual game would be crazy, you know what I'm saying? And just to see all my accomplishments, you know what I'm saying? That, I feel like that would be a great one to add to it. I love that. Uh, Mo Buckets, what about you? T tell us about your 2K background. Um, well, um, me being one of the oldest uh, OG in the community um, it has been a, an amazing ride for me to be able to um, bring a high energy, um, good vibes to the 2k community a lot of people look up to me i get a lot of dms daily from everyone uh older people young people telling me my buckets you inspire me to continue streaming keeps uh, uh becoming a a better person uh of myself and uh you i'm like they're very proud of me so that has definitely uh, and it always touches me when I get uh, when I get people to DM me uh, telling me that stuff. So it means that I'm headed in the right path uh, to success in this 2K community. And uh, um, not only that, just carrying out a good message uh, to the world and uh, 2K people just makes me happy. And not only that, to top it off, to becoming a mayor, oh my God, that would be great. And yeah, it means the whole world to me. Love that. Uh, Bash World, you are one of the less heralded people, but top five in rep uh, for the Beast of the East. You've been a critical piece uh, to them. Tell us, for those of uh, the community that don't know you, about your 2K history and uh, what being top five in the rep it, it means to you in terms of being the mayor. Um, well, NBA 2K is just amazing for me. Like, I started playing this game. Uh, the first NBA 2K with uh, Iverson on the cover. Uh, I've been playing this game since you guys. Uh, it's I've been legend three times in a row, about to be four times. I've dedicated hours to this game. Uh, I, I get on this game every day. I play for about 12, 14 hours. 
uh, I play with everybody too, man. When I get on this game, I I I, I enjoy playing. Whether you're a top rep or a lower rep, my, I, I get on this game and we just have a great time. I'm I I know I'm the underdog in this situation, but I, I feel like what I would bring to the table would be just so many amazing things, man. So much out. We talking giveaways. We talking. Uh, 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 you got somebody to play with when you get on this game, man. I, I enjoy this game and I'm, I'm, I just want to say to the if beast of the East, if I'm the mayor of beast of the East, we're going to, it's going to be fun. It's going to be enjoyable. And, and if you guys don't know my, my name is bash world. And for those that don't know, my name is bash world. And, and, and I represent the underdog. That's, that's what I want to say. I'm a little nervous. Sorry about that, but I represent the underdog and, and I want to get that clear. I, I want to let you know that I'm here for you guys. And if I'm mayor, I promise, I promise, that them six weeks that I'm mayor, we're going to have the best time of your life on 2K. We're going to be here. We're going to, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm going too long, but. No, you're fine. Okay, yeah, I, we're going to have an amazing time. I mean, yo, you should definitely vote for Bash. Ticino, um, obviously your reputation speaks for itself. But how do you feel like your first term went and uh, you handled your mayorship? Uh, did you meet some of the goals that you had set out uh, at the beginning? Yeah, so for me, obviously I'm sitting on the throne right now and uh, all these guys are competing for my spot. But I feel like for my first term as mayor, I've done a fantastic job. Obviously I'm a competitive player first and foremost. And we had the showdown with uh, Grinding. I was playing with Troyden as my teammate against Grinding and Shake. And obviously we took that one out on the Beast of the East, got some new courts. So I think I've done very well in regards of uh, what I can do. And um, the Beast of the East have been on top of all the events. We've been taking over when people are getting their PS5s, getting the new consoles. A lot of people are DMing me, telling me they want to join the Beast ASAP. And uh, it's just become a, it's become a big thing. And it's been awesome. So I want to ask all of you guys about your goals of being mayor and what you think you'll bring uh, both that is already being done by Ticino as mayor, but what what your maybe spin and potential positive uh, message would be. So uh, let's start with Bash World. Bash. If I became mayor of Beast of the East, I would be a mayor that's visible. I would be someone that when you get on this game, you're going to say, yo, I just seen the mayor. I just was playing with the mayor. I just was, I, I can't believe this from the wreck to the park. I was, it, it, if I became mayor, we would do weekly spotlights on uh, players from Beast of the East. Uh, Are you East. saying that Ticino wasn't visible enough as mayor of Beast of the East? I'm just, I'm just curious. Um, I think Ticino is an amazing person. I think Ticino is the GOAT. I just want to say that respectfully. But uh, as mayor, I mean, I'm, I, I would be, I play this game 12 hours a day, 13 hours, sometimes longer than you that. Do. Every day every day I, I get on this game and I don't just play with like my friends and stuff. I play with, they'll tell you if you're, if you're in my chat or you're around and you want to play, Hey Bash, you want to play? Yeah, let's play. And as may, I'm going to make sure what well, I'm going to play with the, the, it doesn't matter whether you're a top streamer or someone that just got two views. Mayor Bash is going to represent you and I'm going to be there for you. Mo Buckets, how do you respond to that? What do you think uh, your goals will be as mayor and, what might you do differently than Tysino, who's had an incredible run in, run in his first term? You know, you know what? I, I respect I respect Tysino so much. I've been looking up to this man for for, for the longest. Uh, uh, I think he has done a phenomenal job. Uh, but Bash, why wow, you speaking <laughs> some good stuff? I made both for you. <laughs> if I don't make it, uh, but 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 me, uh, what I would do? I mean, I'm a grinder. I grind the game every day, Ronnie, for ten. 11 hours a day. Uh, I love playing with my viewers. I, I mean, I only play with my viewers, my fans. So what I would do, I would probably c create more daily challenges in terms of um, uh, uh, just giving people uh, uh, an avenue so they can showcase who they are and maybe, you know, um, so more people can see it. So they can use more buckets as an avenue to showcase their talents so, so others, people in the world can see it. That's me being a mayor and um, more challenges, a little bit. Uh, I, I'm, I'm very, I'm known for doing tournaments and stuff like that. I would love to throw a few tournaments in there from, 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 uh, from the, uh, from the beast or the east. Stacks, what do you have to say? Obviously, an OG in the community, uh, you know, you get all those hours in as well. So, how are, 
how are you thinking about a mayorship and doing things different than the incumbent mayor, Ticino? Uh, you know, respect to everybody here. Ticino killed it as mayor, just, you know, but when the trailer first dropped, I already made my announcement that I was joining East, you know, off rip. I didn't, I had no idea about mayors or any stuff like that. So yeah, I was why already- why did you do that? For those said, that don't know. You said, why did, oh, cause I'm on the East Coast. I live on the East Coast. I, I'm from Jersey. So I already had it in my, in my mind that I was joining uh, the East. But uh, what I feel like my, my strengths are is just content creation and creativity. I always been big on that, especially on uh, my, uh, you know, my YouTube channel, making videos and stuff like that and content. So bringing creativity and, you know, obviously competition, you know what I'm saying? Everyone loves competition. If you don't, then you probably ain't in the East anyway. You know what I'm saying? So uh, probably those are probably my biggest two things that I bring. You know what I'm saying? I'm not uh, the type to, you know, cookie code, anything like that. So I'm, just, I'm coming straight forward with everything. Uh, as mayor, I feel like you know, I'm out here in these streets as well. I know everybody put in those hours, but I'll be out here in these streets. I'm, I'm out here in these streets right now. I got my 2K sitting right here. So uh, I'm just ready for my logo to change. You know what I'm saying? I got the current 2K logo. So I'm ready to get my logo switched over to the mayor's logo, man. Uh, switching gears for a second, uh, Ticino and Troyden did win the first two-on-two -two game, uh, a showdown, of course, and that allowed them to change up the vibe of the court. Uh, and, and the East is really popping. So talk about like the, the change in music, the ability to kind of customize some stuff, the change in courts that comes with being mayor. Uh, would you change the look and feel? How do you feel about setting the tone for your affiliation? Uh, Stax, why don't you take that one to, to lead off? Uh, you know, uh, obviously uh, everybody that know me know I'm cold at this game. So when it comes to any type of competition as far as like, get in the change course or anything like that. I, I'll, I'll come into things always expecting to win, not hoping to win. You know what I'm saying? Just like I did with the Winter Clash tournament. Uh, you know, I came in there hooping uh, just recently this weekend, last weekend actually. But uh, as far as, you know, court changes, any ideas, stuff like that, I just recently uh, hit 1 million on YouTube. So uh, I'm kind of feeling this gold plaque that I got right there. So I would definitely want to do something uh, gold, you know what I'm saying? Bring a little bit, because I feel like the East, is obviously the most dominant uh, city or, or park in the city. So I, I feel like we got to, you know, make it more royalty-like, you know what I'm saying? So we got to add some gold somewhere up in here, man. Got to get it right. I like that. A little black and gold. Uh, the, the, that makes sense. Uh, yes, Bob Buckets, what, what do you think? Well, I, I like what he just said. I, I, he's very confident. I love, I love your confidence, Stax. I, I really like it, though. But you haven't gone a, a, against uh, Mo Buckets, though. Uh, I would love <laughs> to see you on the courts some, sometime so we can sure. go against each other. For sure. Uh, but uh, but me, um, I would do something along the same lines as uh, Tysina did it. I thought it was phenomenal. I thought he did a phenomenal job on that. Yeah. Bachelor, what about you? What do you think about the vibe of uh, the Beast Beast? Well, uh, I, first thing I want to say is... Uh, when I become mayor, if I do, if you guys vote me in, first thing we're going to do is we're going to keep that winning mentality. Beast of the East on top. We're going to go out there and we're going to keep that winning mentality. That's the first thing. The second thing we're going to do is, yes, we are going to change those courts. We're probably going to make them a little bit brighter, probably a little reddish going on. And I want to say, for those that load in the park and go, hey, where you at? I'm going to try to ask Ronnie. Can we get some numbers on the court? Maybe court one, two, three, four, five, six. So you know where you're going. And of course, my favorite color is red. So we're probably going to get some red going on in there. You know what I'm saying? And that's where we're going to go with it. If I'm your Beast of the East mayor. When rival days come around and they are uh, this upcoming weekend, how are you inciting the community to show up, participate, and go get those Ws? <laughs> And Bash, this is a tough one for you because of the four people, you have the the least following. So how are you going to, uh, you know, compensate for that and, and get that message out? Well, I, I want to say this. First off, I want to say, uh, I know, I, like I said, I'm the underdog in the situation, but I know there are a lot of people that can relate to me personally. I, I You know, being that underdog, that I represent the voiceless. So... I would definitely put it out on all my social medias, not to mention I am a content creator. I edit my own videos. I upload, upload my own videos. So I would I would go crazy uploading videos. Maybe I would prep before 
like, you know, awareness, create that campaign for Rival Day. I'm looking forward. I can't wait. I got people on call. This I'm like, listen, I'm sending out messages. I'm using my platform, you know what I'm saying, as 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 an upcoming mayor. You know, I'm going to use my platforms in the right way, you know, and, and just get people out there, man, as many people as I could, you know what I'm saying? Tysino, I you know, you mentioned earlier that, uh, you guys have had a lot of success uh, top of the leaderboards for these events, uh, the, the attendance for them. But rival days um, are a whole different animal. How are you going to kind of keep that momentum going? And what, uh, what's going to be different about getting people to show up and get Ws for the Beast of the East? Yeah, so for me, if I'm being honest, I think all the beasts are already behind me. We've got a, we've got a strong, strong, strong group of people, as you mentioned. We've uh, been winning all the events so far. As you can see, guys like Mo Buckets, they joined the beast because of me. They all believe in me. They all believe in the system. And um, in terms of rival day, we're just going to go out there. It's going to be a war, but we're ready for the fight. And uh, we're ready to take this take this on. Beast of the East. The confidence of the Beast of the East. Mo Buckets, are you just going to say that Taisido has the play and we're just going to go with Taisido? <laughs> well, you know what? I, oh, my God. This is insane. But you know what? I, I, you know, I, I'm not I'm not a big talker. I just do. I just go out there and, uh, and grind and work hard and, and, you know, true. Lead, and lead by example. So uh, they, these guys may have me on the talk. But you know what, though? When I Once I get out there, I'm going to show people uh, – and I'm going to be a leader for these people to understand that Beast of the East is going to win every event and that we're going to do great. And like I said, uh, I'm going to try to showcase the best of the best. And that's the Beast of the East. And yeah, I think, I, you know what, to Ronnie, I think Bash, I don't know, Bash, you're promising a whole lot of stuff, man. You know, How, so, are, you, how are you going to deliver all that stuff? Bro? You know, so crazy, Mo. This is why I'm so excited to be in this room. I definitely deserve to be in this room. And I'm going to tell you why, because... The opportunity that I'm given here is something that I've done daily that has been just people haven't had the opportunity to see. So now that I'm able to get eyes and views, like every day when I'm on, I'm, I'm doing certain giveaways and I'm uploading constantly every day. Not to mention I'm editing my own videos. I'm playing for 14, 15, 16 hours. I've said that multiple times, but I just want to let everybody know, you know, uh, <laughs> yes, I'm doing this. So it's nothing new. It's just that now I get magnified. I get the I get people to see this, so that, so we can have fun, you know. How are you empowering people to come play for you at the Beast of the East? That's different than Tysino, because otherwise Tysino is just gonna walk to a re-election. I want to hear what's gonna be different. Well, first and foremost, like you said, I do got a million subscribers. So you feel me? Uh, I'm, I'm out here, so I'm definitely you know trying to feature a lot of Beast of the East members in my content come moving forward. As mayor, uh, I know the, it's a huge responsibility to be mayor, so I got to be out here in the streets a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? Especially playing with new people. I already started playing with different people as of uh, this year, uh, playing uh, next gen. So playing with more people, just being out here a lot more, man. And I'll be out here, man. I'll just be hopping on here by myself, too, playing with randoms, picking up people. But as far as uh, rival day and getting doves, man, I feel like, a lot of the coldest players are going to want to come play for me anyway because they know I'm nice on this game and they're going to want to come over here and rock with your boy anyway. Uh, I, like I said, I, I'm always about competition, trash talk. I'm with all of that stuff right there. So if that's what you're all about, you feel me, then you're going to rock with me. That, right. that's, I feel like it's that simple, man. I, I Like, honestly, I don't feel like there's much more to be said. If you like competition, you're going to vote for me. If you're not, if you don't, you soft, you're going to vote for somebody else. Simple. What makes you the best mayor of the four people here. And I, I want to hear directness. I want to feel as a community member that you are going to be able to compel our affiliation to victories in a way that these other three are not. So Mo Buckets, since you're Tysino's biggest fan, I want to start with you. What do you have to say about uh, being the best leader among the four of the people that are sitting before us? Well, I, I, like I said, I respect Ticino. Ticino is a phenomenal leader, but I, I just feel that I'm I'm gonna be out there a little bit more than 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 him. Uh, I, I I I bring a winning mentality every time I play with a lot of randoms. I and I'm always winning games, and then I'm gonna bring that same mentality to to the beast of the east. And uh, me being a mayor, I'm sure that's gonna trigger down to everyone else. And uh, we're going to be winning a lot. Uh, like I said, Ticino is phenomenal, but I think I could do a better job in terms of uh, bringing that winning mentality and just, just winning every event possible. Ticino, no let me ask you a question then. 
Let's say that you lose to one of these respectful individuals in this re-election. Could you follow them and respect uh, their leadership and not think that, hey, look, I killed it that first term. Uh, why am I not mayor? Um, yeah, of course. I love everybody in this room right now. Uh, they're all great people, great candidates, great grinders. And uh, being mayor has been an amazing honor, an amazing opportunity. I would absolutely love to get reelected. I believe the beasts all believe in me, and I, I believe I will get reelected. I think I'm the best player in this room, and I think a lot of people believe that, and a lot of people are going to stand by that, and they're going to support me, and they're going to feel the energy come off me. And uh, it's, and I, I feel like my energy inspires people to compete, and I think that's what they love. So yeah, I mean, there's no yeah. doubt the silent confidence has worked for you and, and led you guys to very many victories. Bash, as the underdog that you mentioned over and over again, what makes you the best leader of the four people here? Listen, Beast of the East, as the underdog, I know I'm sitting against, I'm, I'm up against three goats. I, I understand this, but I want you to know, when you come out of Rookieville, I'm going to be there for you. I'm the guy that you're going to see out there that you can send an invite to and say, hey, you Bash, let's run. And I'm right there, no matter whether you're a rook, whether we're a pro or elite, I'm going to be there for you. And in fact, we're going to do a lot of things. Uh, I'm going to set the tone for me. Not to say that it hasn't been set, but I'm going to set the bar even higher. I mean, we're going to do tons of great things. I'm going to put spotlights on my, you're, I'm going to do weekly spotlights on players out of Beast of the East so that you guys can be acknowledged for representing Beast of the East. I want you to feel like you're a part of this. And that's what Bash is gonna bring to the table. I'm Yes, we're gonna do giveaways because Bash love giveaways. So we're gonna do giveaways. That's none of, we're gonna do all of that stuff, but I want you to know that you mean something to Beast of the East. I want you to know that you got Bash. And that's what I want them to know. I want, I want them to understand that. I want them, I want you guys to really, I'm gonna set the tone. I'm gonna make sure that we do things. We have fun, positivity, and um, I'm here for you guys, you know? In the great history of civilization, there have been many leaders that have been excellent, but that does not mean that the next leader should not strive to be more excellent. So Stax, what are your thoughts there? Are you the best leader of the four people here? Will you evolve on the leadership that's, that uh, Ticino had in his first term if you are elected mayor? What's funny is about that, I wish I wish y'all could see my screen right now. I'm sitting right here. Like I said, I'm, on a, I'm, I'm out here in the neighborhood and, I, and my, my player just sitting down in the middle of the street and I have like seven people just sitting around next to me right now currently. So, you know what I'm saying? As far as being a leader, I'm already out here. A lot of people that's gonna be watching this, some of your favorite content creators, looked at me as, you know, a person that inspired them to become a content creator. So as far as being a leader, I feel like my reputation as that is already, you know, already out there, you know, beyond just, beyond just 2K, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I said earlier, a lot of people started their YouTube channel. A lot of people started grinding. A lot of people started playing 2K uh, heavily because of, you know, what I've done in the community and all of the content that I've been creating over the years. So as far as being a leader, there's no doubt in my mind that I could, you know, elevate. Could you be a better leader than Ticino? That's what I that's want what I, That's what I was getting to. There's no doubt in my mind that I can elevate as far as being a leader, as, as far as being a leader and take it to the next level, man. I'm, I'm ready for it. I feel like I was, I'm built for it. And, uh, you know, I'm ready to do what I got to do. He is built different. I mean, Stax, I've known you a long time. You were at the first community day. Uh, you are an old head. Uh, I, 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 I'm going to like to see your campaign. Okay. And then final words from the incumbent himself, Ticino. Ticino, take it away. Well, the Rival Day Championship is on the way. I've already led the beast a long, long way. We've uh, won the Mayor Showdown. We've been top of every event so far. Now we've got the Rival Day Showdown. I'm here for you guys. I'm ready to go into battle with y'all. It's going it's, it's to be a great time. I can't wait. Can I ask you a tough question about that, Ticino, real quick? I know I promised that was my last question, but okay. yeah. say the beasts of the East do not win Rival Weekend. Do you think that your mayorship should be very in jeopardy? Because the voting will happen the I'm gonna, day I'm gonna after be, I'm Rival gonna be Day shut, I'm going to be shut up honest with you. If the Beast don't win Rival Day, if we do not come out on top, I should not be mayor. Wow. 
because oh. I, I I have put my heart, my soul, my I put everything into this, and and I'm very confident we're gonna win. And if we don't win this, all my talk is for nothing. So amazing. All right. Well, you guys heard him. He has now made one of his goals to win the first rival weekend. And if he does not, he is open to being subject to one of the other candidates taking this spot. So let's see how it shakes out. Uh, mayoral candidates, thank you guys so much for your time. It's been very great to hear from all of you. I'm sure the community really appreciates it. Good luck uh, on rival weekend working together. And then on thank Monday, you. You. you will be against each other as we go to our voting uh, to pick who is going to be the next mayor of the Beast of the East. Thank you very much for watching.